ignition, lift off. Close cooperation between man and machine has been crucial for the success of unmanned space missions. There may be nobody on board, but people continually monitor each operation. Their task is to intervene when necessary. The vision of Next Gen IMR is to bring this proven way of working into subsea operations, from outer space to ocean space. Vehicles which operate underwater today are connected to a ship by a tether. This demands a ship, people on board, and good weather conditions. In the future, subsea inspection, maintenance, and repair operations will be smarter, safer, and cheaper. This means no ship and no cable, but underwater vehicles which solve tasks autonomously. In Statoil, we have more than 550 subsea wells in operations. Cost-efficient subsea interventions is very important for Statoil. We therefore invest in and support next-gen IMR. Working close to subsea installations carries high risk. Knowing the exact position of the vehicle is critical to navigating and carrying out tasks autonomously and safely. Risk management systems, similar to buffer zones applied in air traffic management, are also needed. We have addressed the challenge of localization and risk management during operations. This is a key step towards more autonomous operations. Our research makes it possible to switch between operator control and autonomous control during IMR operations. When man and machine work in harmony, we find the best of both worlds. This research is an important stepping stone towards the ultimate goal, fully autonomous systems in the ocean space.